Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Mark Stubborn, and let's get right into the video. That's basically me. I don't know what I did. I just drew me. I thought I was going to do this intro, but I didn't do it. I tried my best to draw it. So, um, okay, number one, let's, let's just get right into it quick enough. Okay. I personally don't like Moon. These are characters I don't like in the Wings of Fire. I actually, I just don't, I think she's too overpowered and can just take on anyone around him. Like, dreads, that used to be dreads, like normal dragons, really are, and every character just takes out dragons like it's nothing, don't they? Sorry the, for the crappy drawing, but they just take out characters like mm, left and right, like yeah, you're done, you're done, you're done for, you're done too. I just honestly don't like it. Let's just choose a background for me, but I don't like how Moon's too overpowered, I'm not gonna lie. I like the show Wings of Fire, which I mean book series, Wings of Fire, but I honestly think they could have done more with, um, is there, what's she called, Blade. I think they could have done more with her instead of just making her the weak sister out of Sandwar Succession. I honestly do think... They could have done more. Um, uh, I really, I'm not gonna lie. I think, um, what he called, um, Este Win, um, Winter is a good character. Yeah, him. I think he's one of the better characters. I'm not gonna lie. I, I think I like his brightness and like, oh God. I like how he thinks he's better than everyone else. I just, I just, I don't know why. I just do. I think he, I like how he thinks he's better than everyone else. I, I think he's a cool character. He's one of my favorites. He's actually, he's my favorite. I'm a fan, but yeah, I'm just telling my true opinion. I really don't like Moon. I, I think Darkstalker is overrated as a good character. He's not even that good of a character. I don't know. This probably is gonna this this video is gonna be so much with this one. The wings of fire put my on. This is my first time uploading a video. My first video ever. Um that's supposed to be uh nails I'm sorry. Um you know what I don't like? I don't like how at the beginning when Glory was during when in when the Dragon Head Prophecy I don't like how they made the um, the night the the rain wings so power. No, I'm sorry. I don't like how they just automatically. Oh, here we go. Um, the rain wings have this spit ability. Wow, like I never thought that. Like, why would you do that? Now I think what. So what else has secret powers, right? And I I didn't like that. Like, but aren't they supposed to be weak? I really didn't like that surprise. That's just my opinion. You might disagree. Most people will, because everyone loves the beginning, the first book. But that's just my opinion. I'm guessing. That's just my opinion. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Why would I lie? Um, number two. Um, why am I saying number two? Um, I actually think the Night Wings should have been a little less powerful. And I know at the beginning they're like the weak one. Well, the rain wings were really the weak one, but they were like the really weak one. They're like, oh, you have no abilities like the rain wings. The rain wings were worse because they weren't for war. Oh God, I missed it. They weren't for war. But I honestly think, but now that they have all these powers and they're like the center of attention, I don't like it. I'm not gonna lie, I don't like it. I honestly don't like it. You know, I do like them. I do like... Oh, let me say this. I don't like how Queen Maroon never got her own little thing. Like, the Seaweed Queen did. Everyone did except Queen Maroon. And Queen, Queen Glacier got her own thing. I said Winter Book 7, 
Why didn't you? I would have really. We never really saw anything about the Mud Kingdom except in book one where they looked for his father, didn't they? I honestly. Sorry about the Adam. I honestly don't like that. I think they could have done something good with him. Oh, let me talk about this little quick plot hole. I'm making it clear so less people could see this little, but they could still see an outline when I put the red in. I think. I think this is a plot hole. My, I think I might be wrong, but I do think that there's a plot hole in book 11. Oh, there's spoilers. Ah, oh, I should have said that earlier. Sorry. Uh, but okay. Uh, let me continue. I honestly, there's a plot hole. Not gonna lie. The plot hole is that. I said, you know, when, um, um, what was he called? Sundru, Cricket, and Swordtail were traveling underground to, in a tunnel under the hive in book 11. They dig a hole, right? From the greenhouse. And they magically found the place hidden where Blue was. I mean, first of all, that sounds a little bit weird. They were digging a hole in the hive. Mm, and if you say, um, Esther, but they were, um, but they were going underground to save him because they, they didn't know he was underground. They knew he was trapped somewhere, but not underground. How could they do? Maybe he was in the hive somewhere, like in an important section, near his queen. How would they know where he was underground? And second of all, if they didn't know he was underground, why were they traveling? I don't know. Well, they sh they they should not be attacking the the hive wings because they stand literally zero chance. I think that's a plot hole, and I did not like that when I read it. All right, moving on, though. I do not like that thing, though. Okay, then, you know what I do like? It's the... Oh, sorry. Um, okay. Oh, another thing I think they should have done is I think they should have paid more attention to the sand wings. I know the sand wings are expression and quibbly, but... I I think they should have gave them, like, uh, no, the mud wings, I'm sorry. The mud wings is a better example. They, they, they didn't have any ability. They, their abilities were really boring. They could be fired if they are warm enough. Worse for the mud wings. That's why it shows them. They were a stem. They could breathe underwater for an hour. Who really cares, except in the first book. That came useful. That never came useful, except in the first book. Yeah. Who really cares? They were strong and bulky. That's a good thing for them. But I honestly don't know. I think they should have given the Mudwings a better set of weapons. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I really don't think. I don't know. I think they just should have gave the Mudwings a better set of weapons. Because the Mudwings were never really touched on. Never in Queen Maroon. I might be wrong, because I've read the book in like a, a year. Wow, I've been reading these books for that long. Jesus Christ. But I haven't read the book in like a year, because I just... I took like a year break from it. I'm not going to lie. I did. I just like... Hmm. Mm, I don't know. I'm not going to do this. Um, I, and I stopped reading, because I got bored of it, and then I'm back into it again. So, I really, like, if they, sh um, oh, yeah, and I don't like how they, the old characters just suddenly become unimportant. They just become unimportant really way too quick. I'm not gonna lie, like, Tsunami and stuff. She just becomes a side, like, a side character. And Este, all of this. And the whole Jade Mountain thing. She was in there for a while. She got kidnapped, didn't she? Oh, and it was really convincing that an old lady 
an old lady gave is the what's he called um kibli or something oh kibli yeah kibli i don't know what's his name it's the sand wing the one that is in the prophecy with it's the winter and moon i think really obvious that in the near the end when he was trying to find it one an old lady i know she was clear sight gave him the map to where este i don't know if he's a clear sight actually but gave him to map to where tsunami was that's really weird i didn't like that i was like really i mean sorry for the food it's disgusting i mean really why would that what are the odds like wouldn't she like why would you do that i don't i don't know i know she was on the good right side but it's really obvious it's it's just to get oh she probably forgot oh yeah tsunami's gone and just say this old lady gave her the thing let's think we'll just call her clear sight because that makes a tiny bit of sense and how was clear sight revived that's my question the dark doctor used but he couldn't and why did he make the clone in the room remember when moon found out that um dark stalker was doing all these crazy bad things i don't know i honestly don't i just think that's really bad like what were you thinking I think they should have done better. So, yeah, I'm just talking a bit. I this is gonna wrap up here, and uh, let me just finish this quick flip, and I'll talk about Wings of Fire tomorrow.